हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज़ अनुराग सिंह एंड आई विल बी प्रेजेंटिंग माई फाइनल प्रोजेक्ट ऑफ शुगर ऑन रासबेरी पाए लेट मी डिस्कस अबाउट द एजेंडा ऑफ दिस प्रेजेंटेशन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल गो थ्रू द आर पाई डॉक्स देन वी विल सी आर पाई सेंसर्स देन आई विल डिमॉन्स्ट्रेट सम सेंसर्स फॉर यू देन वी विल सी टर्टल आर एक्टिविटी एंड इट्स प्लग इन्स ऑल्सो वी विल बी सींग कंट्रोल सेंटर एंड कैमरा स्पेसिफिकली डिजाइन फॉर आर पाई and then we will wrap up with how we are going to design operating system for the same coming on to the sensor there are three digital sensors which i have mainly used in it also this includes another humidity and temperature sensors as well this is a motion sensor light sensor and ultra sonic distance sensor let me go through the sensors which i have used the sensors here i have written down the code that is to provide the setup and directly using the gui to get the final values without having going through the any hassle to set up the code it extra now what do we need we need first of all the humidity sensors and then we are going to connect that humidity sensor to our gpio plugin pin we can see that there are win ground sda and scl pins which have to be connected to the given points 17 6 3 and 5 after we are done with this this will look something like this here we can see that this is in blue in color is our humidity sensors then we have the four wires going through from the breadboard to our gpio plugin and the gpio pins further facilitate to transfer the data at extra and give us the final measure now we will look that how exactly the code and how execution is done so in our Uh, terminal we will open the activity that is cd rpi sensors you can use that from the uh, central activity uh, center also from sugar labs i am using terminal right now now i will uh, put on the uh, things that are the gpio plugins it extra and in some time we will be able to see the readings of the humidity sensors we can see it saying 79% yes i am currently living in quite a humid area that's why the humidity is quite high similarly we can see the motion detected motion sensors is also in act as i have connected them as well now coming on to the distance sensors distance sensors uh, we are specifically using the ultra uh, uv distance sensors in which we can see two parts the first part is the one which takes in the uh, signal and the other part is which emits out they are connected to the gpio plugin again and the numbers of these plugins are uh, we can see them here so they have to be connected via these pins the ground pin the 17th 16th and the 21st pin and after the connection is done we can use the power on trigger and then we will be able to see all the stuff now coming on to the rpi docs it is very important uh, this covers almost everything from setting up sugar on raspberry pi to installation guide to how do we set up the activities the different activities that we can set up and utilize uh, here we can see the installation guide for example Here I have written out everything from step to step. That how you have to download the image first, then flash that image into the micro SD, then boot the Raspberry Pi and get the upgrade it extra. Finally, installing Sucrose and setting up the config manager. Now one might think that how exactly will the setup look? The setup will look something like this. Here we can see there are four cables going through. The first cable is the power cable. The second cable is the HDMI cable, and there are two ports. The two ports are keyboard and mouse it extra. it is working through ssd lan anything can work from here and next we are, uh, we uh, i have also planned to include all the activities which is guide to the sugar activities which will be done in some time including one or two days because the documentation part is done i have to just write a proper version of it so that it can be understandable by the people now uh, moving on to the r pipe plugin which can be utilized in the turtle art, art specifically the rpi plugin which we are going to see is similar to the uv and the uh, distance and the oled display is extra here and everything is written down in the uh, electronic component and sensor part here explanation is uh, self suffice and we have to set up all the uh, as we have done previously the setup the setup is exactly the same just we have to open the turtle art activity and going in the plugin will facilitate us 
next on moving to the rpi control center now one might wonder that what when uh, when i am setting up these activities how i am going to know that whether it's connected or not or whether the provided network is working or not so here comes the rpi control center rpi control center is a one way stop where you can have i2 interface spi interface camera interface vnc interface sss interface auto login and the cli and gui it extra it helps us to facilitate the uh, whether which uh, particular gpio plugin is connected it help us to facilitate that uh, which of the following i2c devices uh, assembly is connected it extra next on moving with the camera camera has certain features example image preview camera preview grid overlay flip options and uh, record and uh, screenshot options are also present this can be utilized perfectly with raspberry pi moving on to the next part which is that how we are going to design the rpi image rpi image include the five stages which are bootstrap minimal system light system desktop center and cor uh, corresponding to a raspberry pi image now these are uh, very unique steps and they have to be done very Uh, perfectly and with the proper setup it extra required because for example in 64 bit or in a, a chip that doesn't include arm it extra it it becomes very difficult to say do the same creating a custom rpi image is a quite a task in it itself but it it has to be done and it will be done and that's all from my side thank you everyone and i'm hoping to co conclude this project in a week or two with some of the brush ups it extra that has to be done and i'm very happy to share that i have made to the sugar labs organization the contributor uh, contributions it extra and the mentors they were very helpful to me and helped me in each and every steps currently i'm working with them and in a week or two this project will be completed as a whole thank you everyone